Hey, Drive By Reviews here. Welcome to an edition where we're looking at a game that I'm not familiar with, but I am now. I guess I didn't used to be familiar with it. Mikado Spiel. Mikado Spiel? Something like that. Anyways, it's kind of like the old pickup sticks game, really. You guys remember that? One, two, pick up my shoe. Three, four, shut the door. Is that how it goes? <laughs> Alright, so here's the packaging. What do you got inside? A bunch of these sticks. Now, I'll post the rules below. But what you get in the packaging is all the sticks to play the game itself. And the rules. And these rules come with... Regle du ju. Uh, not sure what... Okay, a bunch of different languages. Looking for English. Looking... Rules of the game. Excellent. Alright, so. The Mikado with the spiral is special. Because you can use this one to remove other sticks. Yellow rings are worth 50 points. Wow. These guys are worth 50 points. 25 points for blue rings, 30 points for red rings, and 20 points for green rings. All right, and what's funny is, the way to play this game is extremely simple. It's more of a kid's game. You just have two players, decide who goes first. You can play rock, paper, scissors, or something like that. The player brings uh, sticks over here and he just drops them. Boom, there you go. And you can pick them up one at a time, but you have to pick them up without moving any other stick. And I mean any other stick. So if anything moves at all, your whole round, your turn is done, and you're trying to get the most amount of points. So it can be kind of tricky because as you look here, you say, oh, there's a lot of stuff I can pick off the top. But if something's pushing, like that one right there, it's not going to stay in one spot, then you're going to have problems. So right here, let's start with this one. Easy, right? Got a yellow one. Okay, what's next? Uh, let's pick up this one. Let's try it. Ah, oh, they all moved. Did you see that? So my turn will be over with that one stick, I believe. I don't think I get the second one. Or no, I guess I get both. I get both. Um, and then the next player would say, okay, my turn. And they would grab all these sticks. Stack them up. They would drop their own sticks. Okay. <laughs> when they roll away completely, they're really easy to get. Oh, man, look at this guy. Ah, <laughs> that was a trap. <laughs> All right, and then they would team, you would uh, total up those points, doing a set amount of rounds. I've seen another way people play where they will drop it, and the players will take turns based on, you know, someone uh, having a stick move. So, for example, I would do my turn until one moved, and I would keep those points, and then the next player would do his turn until one moved, right? And just keep going back and forth until all the sticks are picked up, and then you would total the points there and see who won. So that's another way to play. Now, it's obviously a game of a little bit of finesse coordination, right? Kind of reminds me of Jenga mixed with pickup sticks. But there you have it, a very kind of easy to transport, simple game. They are kind of fun for, it can be fun for all ages. And, uh, yeah. Oh, under three bucks. Can't beat that. Mikado Spiel. So if you guys are looking for a nice transportable game, I mean, look how big this is so small. Could fit in anything. Suitcase package. Make a nice gift for the kids at Christmas. Mikado Spiel. Make you cry out more than Jenga. I wonder if you cry out Mikado. Mikado. Mikado? I think it's Mikado. I wonder if you cry, sh shout that out when it's about to... Nah, I guess it doesn't work like Jenga. <laughs> well, there you have it, guys. A nice, cool stick game. Pick one up if you feel interested. Might even get one in the mail for free sometime. That happens on occasion. They just randomly show up, I hear. All right, thanks for tuning in.